Good day, re-imprisoned prisoners. I'm on silence and we're on the air with more Resident Evil code. <laughs> ah, crap. <laughs> Welcome, Claire. Consider the area you are in a special playground I have prepared just for you. Please try and keep me amused, and do not disappoint me by dying too soon. I so want to enjoy this. <laughs> what a laugh. It's episode number five of Code Veronica. Thanks for tuning in last time out. Last time out, we figured out some of the way forward. And now we've uh, been trapped and forced to only go forward and not back. It even vibrates when it does the, um, the heartbeat sound effect there. God, they're taking their sweet-ass time with this door animation. You can't skip it, either. Oh, it's got a door animation to the door animation. Dark in here. That's not looking good. The big crack there, unaddressed. Oh, what have we got? Submachine guns, not loaded. Take the submachine gun. Okay, we're basically out of room at this point. There's ammo for the submachine gun. Okay. Well, we just gotta get down then. Ah, uh, what the goddamn. Now would be a good time to have a submachine gun. I'm not sure. Oh. Oh. You can't dodge. Dodging is not a mechanic in this game. On orange caution, because dodging's not a mechanic in this game. How do we kill this thing? He made a noise. Ah, for the love of Christ. Oh, good. Now we can go down. I wonder if, like, certain enemies have certain weaknesses, like... Like, firing this into it would have been a better shout than... than the gun. Hmm, 69 bolts left. Nice. Or should I have healed right there? No, not yet. Okay, maybe yet. Nope. Now it's got me. It's gonna crush my cranium. Nope. Don't look now, but Steve's an action hero. Oh, with the no look shots and everything? Come on. Yeah, that felt good. So what are you in jail for? Don't worry, Claire. Your knight in shining armor is here. You wish. But thanks for the help. See? This is why you need me. I got your back. Whatever. Here. Take these. Machine guns? For me? You know the deal. In exchange for your Lugers. <laughs> Okay, okay. Well, we've traded out the uh, submachine guns with no ammo for the Lugers that Steve has used up all the ammo with. <laughs> this thing is too cool. Yes! Now this is my kind of weapon. All right! Huh? <laughs> hey, this thing's empty. You cheated me. Up there, plenty of ammo just for you. Way up there? 
Give me a boost and I'll get it for you. All right, all right. Ow! My back! You're heavier than you look. Hurry up! Happy now? What? We're going down, that's what. Now that your knight has made his appearance, he can join you in your descent into death. Okay, let's do it! Wait here, Claire! Time to test out my new toy! <laughs> okay, I'll wait here, you go get yourself killed. Or I'm playing as... Or I'm playing as Steve now. One or two other, how many, uh... 96. Ah, son of a bitch. I tried to move and I wasn't moving. I don't have anything else to shoot with, so I gotta, I guess, be judicious with my ammo. I need a, I'm assuming, blue key card? Because it's, oh, indigo blue. Oh, there's a shotgun through the, I see you. Okay. Oh, there's some uh, grenade rounds. So it won't let me pick up the grenade rounds. What do we got here? Family photo. I know it's a family picture, but... Nothing on the back. Steve and his parents. Steve Burnside. Who, uh... Say about 5.7-ish? Well... Oh no, because 5.6... No, uh... 6.76. Six. So that would make him about... Uh... 5.8-ish, because 5.75... Five, five would make him 5.9. So we'll call him 5.8-ish. Type AB. Universal recipient. Well, assuming he's AB positive, he'd be a universal recipient, which is a good blood type to have. But he's also 5'8", less than 150 pounds, soaking wet. So. Mm. Says this Steve, who's about 5'11", and 180 or 90, depending on how he's feeling in a good day, so. When was the last time I went to doctor? I was at about 5... Oh, 5'11". 170... Oh, something broke out of here. Ugh. Is it 174? Oh, he turboed into me! That rat bastard. Uh, where was I? Yeah. Nothing useful? That's not good. Then Steve's got no hit points because he weighs 150 pounds soaking wet. Secured with a simple lock that Steve can't break. I have no idea if I'm aiming at anything. Okay, what, what's this? Chemicals used for gun maintenance. Handgun part placed on the desk. I, it cannot be used with a submachine gun. Is there anything here I can use? So I can upgrade the handgun if I get back here with Claire. Got it. I'm getting the hint. And I was going to say, no, the, the part that was interesting was my blood pressure. It was like 139 over 89 or something like that. That was on a Monday morning. So I'm sure if it had... If they had gotten to me like a midday Friday when all hell was broken loose for a whole week of accumulated crap. Just shoot the one in front of you, Steve. 
God, Steve might be the. Ah, just. If you could shoot one target at a time, you idiot, this would be a lot easier. But no, you have to be a dumb. Why are you shooting two things? Why? Just shoot the target in front of you. God, Jesus. God. Steve does have a death wish. Oh, is this a map? May breaker may fail due to overload. In case of failure, raise the liver as illustrated. The ventilation device will resume operation. Oh, we're not levering anything, are we? But the ventilation seems to be working because it's ventilating the poison gas. You know it's poison because it's green. And if it was Pokemon, it would be purple, but it's not, so it's green. Creepy face on the wall. It was dirty work, but this area is now clean. See? You can depend on me. You see? This thing is a lot more reliable than any person. Than people? Steve. What were you doing here? Who brought you here and where is your family? Shut up! I don't want to talk about it! No, he's doing the point break. Steve. Steve! Never mind. Let's get going. Dang, I was hoping I could get back in and get, you know, all the parts that are there, but... No. No. I must follow Steve. <sighs> Indigo card reader. Steve went through this door. There's a hole there, so we aren't going that... Oh, I can't... Oh, it's... oh, come on now. It's not that far of a drop. Told you. Claire, are you okay? Steve, behind you! No! What's wrong, Steve? Shoot him! Wait! I... I can't! No! Steve! Steve! No! I'm amazed he didn't hit Claire once with all those completely overkill bullets. I mean, ain't no party like an overkill party, but... Steve... Father... Father... Fa 
father. <laughs> Dad I used to work for Umbrella. I tried to steal information, intending to sell it off to the highest bidder. He was caught. Mom was killed. We were sent here. Oh, Steve. He was a fool to do something so reckless. So stupid. Now he's Swiss cheese. It's okay now. Just rest. Now we get to take back over as Claire, unfortunately. It's under repair. I can't drive it. I was actually more interested in the toolbox, but nothing in the toolbox either. Something up there on the... Yeah, I saw that. I caught that. Oh, only 15, though. I was hoping it would give me a bonus for spotting the hard-to-spot thing. A lift. The battery has been removed. Okay. Noted. So we can go out that way. This doesn't seem to... Large size relief. The imagery appears to be telling a legend. Oh, but you're not going to tell me what legend. So now, which that goes that way. Let's go this way first, because it's on the right, and you always go right, etc., etc. Yeah, now I need it. Ha already. Can we get into an old tank is being displayed here? This could be suited to Alfred's taste, so can't just hop in the tank. Nice and slow. All right. Nope, wrong one. This one. All right, so I've unlocked the door. It means I could get through it either way, which I don't want to rush to because. You know, giant killer thing. Uh, giant sandworm on the other side of it, so. We're, we're good to pass on that for a minute, you know? There's another door over here. Nothing hiding under anywhere. Well, it's worth a shot, because I could use some healing! Alright, there's eight, nine, ten. 
なあハンドガンボルツハイデンバッヒー What's this over here? Which way do you want to take? I have a feeling about staying on the floor. Don't ask me why, I just feel like this is the right call. It seems to be a picture of this room. Oh, indigo. I'm trying not to waste my ink ribbons. But at the same time, I feel like this is ink ribbonable. Call me paranoid. But I feel there's just too much trouble afoot. Of this room specifically, though? Because the Napoleon portrait is here. Man's portrait is displayed here. I mean, who knows? I mean, uh, maybe uh, Albert is five foot four and has a Napoleon complex. Now, here's an indigo blue plate. We've been looking for one of these. The eagle plate. I was waiting for trouble. Still waiting for trouble. I'll take the lift. They're on the first floor. Two? Cool, we get that animation. Even if we have to get this, at least we get a, like a animation of. Where am I? That requires a card. And this is where we just were with Steve. Okay, so I've gone in a circle. Okay, noted. Then 1F. B1F was where we met Steve. Okay. Not yet. Let's go this way, because we can get the handgun upgrade. What's this say? No regarding device tutor to be read? Well, shit. Now, fortunately, Steve cleared this out, so. I can't get that yet. Because we don't have any ammo for it. Or don't have any room for the ammo. Can't get in that because we don't have a lockpick. Well, we can get some handgun bullets. I 
Oh, we can't use... Really? Handgun part, but we can't use it on the M93R. Well, shit. Chemicals used for gun maintenance. And all this way for nothing. So now we gotta find this indigo blue plate again. So this is where we came in with Steve. But unfortunately, we can't go back this way. Oh, this is the option menu. Hmm. Kind of limited on where we can go. I'd like to get back to because where Albert was at the top of this area. I really want that shotgun too. Where he was at the top of the area. Had a blue plate, yeah? Yeah. Hmm. Okay, not that way. Alright, noted. Hmm. That's where we just got on, wasn't it? Save point, yeah. Let's try. We're going back this way and seeing if we can't make our way back. Now, does the tank thing open up anywhere? It's just here. Door's been welded. Ah, balls, 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 balls. You know what? We're kind of stuck, so let's just go here. Now you can't go... All, all the, the shutters have fallen again, so I don't think... I don't think... I don't think there's anything I need. The Lugers, the Lugers, the Lugers. Right. We'll leverage the Lugers. Nope, that's... a Lou. Well, this is... No, the Lugers were in the main... Yes, okay. I remember where the Lugers are. They weren't in here. I was doing the right thing the first time. Where's the tank when you need it, right? Oh, balls. 
running by them seems to work, too. I hate it when it introduces new enemies to just spawn in on top of you. He fell right off the thing. Inwards and upwards. The Lugers were through here. No! Oh, sight unseen. Shoot him in the... Ah, oh, come on! I'm in real trouble. Okay, well, I'm only on a regular caution. I think we're going to take a break here on this episode of Resi Code Veronica, and then we're going to do the Lugers over there next time out. Let's see where that leads us. And then we got the Indigo Blue Plate, we got the, uh, What's it called? The the the, yeah, the blood clotting medicine. So we got uh, all that to worry about on the next episode of Code Veronica. But until we see you for that, I'm on silent. Thanks very much for joining me. Like the video if you liked it. Subscribe if you're new. Share on social media, follow on social media. The social media handle is on Silent on Air, and that is for Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Tumblr. And don't forget, there's plenty more Resis 1, 2, 3, and Code Veronica and playlists there on the screen in the description down below and more videos any time on the channel page. And until the next time, I'm on Silent. Thanks very much for joining me in the next year. Subscribe, and we will see you next year.